what's up guys today is friday Woo! finally friday because today as you see is the greatest day of the week because today is snap on friday right there's the man so let's see what he's got you guys come on It's Friday. Friday. Man, I don't care who you are. When you walk on a snap-on truck and you see Nipex pliers, one of these big sexy adjustable wrenches, if that don't get your blood pumping, something is wrong with you. You just don't have a love for tools. <laughs> That's what it is. Man. I've got every one of them right there, and I still get excited seeing them. <laughs> That's bad, ain't it? <laughs> it's hard to beat some good nip eggs, though. What you got, the big boy? That is, huh? That, there it is. Might be a little dead. See if the battery rattles on it. Let's check that. What? Can't hear nothing. It ain't got no rattle in it? No rattle. You ain't got to put one of the jersey discount pool <laughs> straps on it the, to keep it The band-aid? Right? Yeah. Or what does he call it? The shock strap. Yeah, shock strap. You think of shock strap, I can think of a couple different things, but it is pretty good idea, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a hoss, ain't it? I need what to is that the, right there? This is where you can do the settings. It's got a speedometer on there. Yeah. So what's the difference in it? Uh, well, you can actually adjust it for like if you want to tighten it. I'd have to look in the book and see. But you got reds and forward, greens and reverse. So you can have settings on both ways. Huh. Full power on reverse. And if you want to go up like half power or whatever it is. Let me look and see if I can see what the settings are on it. I don't see how they build them impacts where they can sell them for $150 a piece. I know. That's crazy, ain't it? I know it. You'd think it'd be more than that, especially with a snap-on name. Yeah. All right, I'm just kidding. Y'all know that, right? Like, <laughs> be getting phone calls everywhere. Yeah, be like, Hamilton, send me one of them $150 impacts. <laughs> you can send them the rubber boot. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be closer to that than the other one. <laughs> yeah. So what is the, the breakaway on there supposed to be? Uh, it says 900 foot-pounds, what, what it claims. All right. It might do 900. We'd have to try it out and see. Well, if you, know you want I mean. us to try it out. <clears throat> been known to try a few. I've been around known here, to uh, try some impacts out. And we've also been known to rip some guts out of them, too. So Yeah, that's for sure. Like, there ain't no guarantee she'll be like she was. It's kind of like... Uh, you know, uh, whistling diesel, taking your truck out for a spin. It may not come back in the same shape that it left in, yeah, but you'll time. know what it can do when, it's, when it comes back. It ain't to be for lack of effort, that's, that's for right. sure. So that's serious when you have to me. read an instruction booklet on how to operate an impact gun. <laughs> like, I'm trying to see the difference in the torque rate. Shit done got real in. We don't want to give no bad information around here. That's right. I'm trying to figure out what all the settings are on <laughs> it. It's a speed selector, it says. Faster and slower? Yep. I like all mine just to run fast all the time. Wide open. Wide open, max torque. Yep. That's the way I like it. Balls to the wall. Yep. Like I like it to be like a drag car. Give me all you got <laughs> every single time. I don't need no. I don't need no half-assing. <laughs> <laughs> Full throttle. That's more like That's it. Right. I don't need you to dial it back on the computer. I want you to dial it up. 
if we break stuff, then we'll deal with that. And we regret that decision later. We'll but. fix it later. That's right. So what's the uh, what's the retail on that bad boy? I may have talked about it last week. I can't remember, but I've slept since then. Yeah, no doubt. The list price is nine forty one ninety five. What list price is on it? That it comes with two batteries and a charger. Yep. Okay. Alright, Tim. Did you get that hog ring yet? Nope. Alright, guys. We're gonna go. <laughs> Are you serious? What are we waiting on? No, it's, I think it's supposed to be coming in either today or FedEx where it's coming in. That'd be, I think, today or tomorrow morning. So if you want to, I'll holler at you tomorrow evening and bring it to you. <laughs> Man, that's crazy. Yeah. I got a 3 8 one out here that I had to fix for somebody. I finally got there, the 3 8 one's in. I was waiting on a little bit colder. All right. Where's when you get that in? Everybody's trying, they was like, how much you want for this? I said, it's already sold, I can't sell it. <laughs> Tell everybody how long it lasted the day I walked on here. Oh, I mean, 30, 40 seconds tops. He's like, anybody got, he said, who's this? You here? had it laying up there on the counter, yeah. remember, when I come in. He said, who's this? I was like, nobody's yet. I just traded for it not long ago. He's like, I want it then. Then yeah. he asked the I price. I didn't ask the price. Yeah. I said, I want it. He said, I want it. Is the battery come with it? I said, yeah. He said, I want it. Now, I don't even know how much it's going to be yet. It may be the same as a new one. I don't know. <laughs> that tells you I trust you right there because I've always done good with trade-in tools on your truck. So I just yeah. said, I'll take it. That's what I mean. I had a set of screwdrivers this morning. The fella traded in a couple of days ago. Or Monday, actually. Sold him to him this morning. As he said the same thing. He walked on the truck. He's on these right here. I said, all right. He said, how much are they? He said, I just put them on my. He said, I don't even need no receipt. He said, I don't need my wife seeing that. <laughs> <laughs> and he'll never ask for a receipt. Yeah. Well, that's good. You'd be surprised the amount of guys that don't, the wives don't see their receipts. I'm sure there's a lot of them out there. More than likely. I can't get away with that because mine just watches the video. <laughs> <laughs> Which mine's mine's cool anyway. She, oh, yeah, she, she ain't never said a word. She killed me at one time. She's like, I ain't gonna use the language she used, but she's like, quit being a wimp and just buy it. You know, that's like when you first started. She's if you want to yeah, buy cause it. Yeah, because I was real pit particular about. Yeah, at first, you was like, I don't know about that. I don't know about and, that. Yeah, I mean, till she went that Saturday was working on stuff up here, and she had to go to Harbor Freight twice same day to yeah, return the same off. tool. She was mad about that. Though. Yeah, she said that's it. They ain't no more. Yeah, she, she said if Joven's got it on the truck, just buy it on the <coughs> truck. She said, if he ain't got it on the truck or can't order it, we'll worry about something else. Yeah. Of course, at the time, he was the only tool truck we yeah. had other than Mr. Joe, and he didn't care a lot of that stuff. So. Hey, yo. Uh, and we did there for the longest. Like, every time something didn't work exactly right, I'd text Joe, and he'd be like, I have it Friday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll never forget that. She was, Shiloh was mad. I hate to even figure out how much, I know you can punch it up on the computer, but I'd hate to even know how much money I've spent on this truck. It's the very first time you showed up. The, the it's first, bad. The first two months is probably a little slow after that. That first yeah. full year, I know you run much through your name and then you run much through your shop name too. But it was. It was a lot. Yeah. It was more than what a lot of people make in a year. <laughs> it was a lot of money. It's embarrassing to think about it, but oh well. I mean. <laughs> I but like, a, I mean, the people it. who get it that understand it, I mean. It's what you make your living with, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, you ain't seeing, uh, you know, uh, Michael Jordan ain't playing basketball with a 99 cent basketball. Yeah, and he ain't running around barefooted either, so. Tom Brady ain't throwing a dollar forty nine, you know, football. Might be a little deflated, but it ain't yeah, no cheap hey, one, though. whatever, that's, that's his preference. <laughs> you know, I like soft grips. <laughs> Yeah, hey, I have no problem with that. <laughs> it won't get a little extra grip on his too, though. Whatever it takes. If I was him, I'd have a needle in my pants, and I'd let it out the way I like it too. Yeah. That's just funny. I like Tom Brady. I do so too. before we get all the hate mail on that one, Tom yeah. Brady's a cool dude. Hey, I don't care if he throws that son bitch flat as long as he throws it like he's been throwing it. I don't like, care what like he does. Like I said, this past week be all right. Yeah, if we can get past Sunday, it's gonna be nice. Well, well, well. I show hoping you had that hog ring in. Yeah. Like I said, I think either today or tomorrow morning, whenever FedEx decides to run, they're not consistent. And I don't get emails from them like I do with UPS. 
Even my UPS driver, he lives about two miles from me. We're actually friends. He either call me or like, well, here lately we get like one box in a week, so that ain't no big deal. But back when we was getting 15 boxes in a, a week and get 10 a day, he'd call me like, all right, asshole, you, uh, I'm going to be there at 5.30. You better be there because you help me unload all this. <laughs> Got a bunch of stuff. Now the UPS guy, when he comes, or the guy that pulls up here, like, he just backs up to the door. Yeah. And, uh, he'd be like, God, oh, look at all these pallets. Like, yeah. Sorry. You know that ain't me, right? <laughs> like, don't get mad at me. I ain't got nothing to do with that. Why are you mind loading three toolboxes here a week? Yep. <laughs> You sold boxes. a bunch of toolboxes out of this shop for sure. Mm -hmm. like this one of... here may be gone today. Uh oh. Had a guy call me yesterday. One of my customers, a good customer. I've, I sold him a box before, a long time ago. And he, uh, he's like, I need another toolbox. He said, What you got? And I told him about this one. I told him about two used ones I still got to pick up that have been traded in. And uh, he said, Well, let me. He said, Come back by here. Let me check it out. Well, Betsy, we're going to miss seeing you on the videos, but you've been here a while. It's this time one, for you to go. This box been here longer than anyone. I don't it's, know. I had that real big, that 72-inch orange one I thought was on the... And I sold it for you. Yeah. <laughs> I just took it off the truck. I got tired of seeing that big sucker on it. I just took it off the truck and parked it in the shop. And sold it. Yeah. I think that same week, you're like, hey, so-and-so wants to buy this I think this I sold you three toolboxes that week. Yeah. I sold you the one Matthew Cox has got, and then the trade-in that Matthew had... Yep. And then the orange box, all in the same same week. Yeah. But I did get a free shirt, a free hat, a free coat that year, or that <laughs> week, or whatever it was. So we did good. Yeah. <laughs> I try to take care of the ones that take care of me, for sure. Hey, you've always been good. That's what I was telling Hamilton at lunch. I said, you know, I was getting ready to go on a little trip this weekend, and I was packing T-shirts because we're going it's pretty warm. And, uh... I noticed every t-shirt I got, I don't have any regular t-shirts. <laughs> every one of my t-shirts is snap-on. Every single one of them yeah. is snap-on t-shirts. How many of them so, you paid for? None. I've never I've never paid for a shirt or nothing on this truck. And no I, mean, hats, I, I take care of, I, when you ask Clay, we had to take a little break from the video because somebody walked up, interrupted us and stuff. But he came on the truck and he wanted to know about a hat and everything's so, well, $15. Mm -hmm. Ain't never bought nothing for me, so. Yeah, I've never, I've never had to pay for any of my snap-on stuff, but like, if you carry underwire and pants on here, like I never have to go shopping again. <laughs> Get some blue jeans. Because all my socks, like, look right there. What brand is that? Snap-on. <laughs> all my socks are snap-on socks, so all my t-shirts are snap-on t-shirts. So I, I need, I need underwire and and britches, and then. You know, if you sell a gallon of milk and some peanut butter on here, I'll never, ever have to go to the store again. <laughs> That's yeah. some snap-on peanut butter. $99 a jar, but boy, it's the best <laughs> peanut butter. It's, they actually break it out of the center of Reese's cups and put it in the jar. That's that would be the best peanut butter there is right there. That's, That's probably why. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Uh -oh. What do what y'all say, though? Fat people get sick and get skinny. Skinny Fat people, people get, get sick. sick and lose weight. Skinny yep. people get sick and die. Yep. So. All right, guys. So we're going to take Hamilton's demo. I like the fact you can shake it and you ain't got no rattle. Pretty impressive. We're going to take his demo this week, and he's going to be uh, getting some of the real deals in, and we'll go from there. All right, guys. Like always, thank you all for watching. If you like the video, Hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools and discount codes down here. If you're not subscribed, click that button. Just press it. Super simple. Easy. You guys have a great week. See ya.